right, I'm gonna, oh, didn't work. Yay, okay, we are going to record this and I'm going to share this, these slides that I have made for you guys. This is our bell blocking and you can follow along the name of your character, but also you each have a little icon. Doesn't it look wonderful? This is our stage, so this is a good time for you to screenshot this page right now and to draw a picture of our stage. So you can screenshot it and print it out, or you can just draw it. Remember, we have um, eight, nine zones and two different balconies. We aren't using any balconies for, um, oh, what happened? We aren't using any balconies for Belle, but we are using all of these zones. So we have um, one through nine, okay? I, I don't have all the zones written down every single time because it's just too much information, but we have the bakery on stage right and the bookshop on stage left. Look how beautiful. This is just a screenshot of it. It's gonna look so much more beautiful on our big LEDs. So this is our cast breakdown and how to write your blocking, which we went over today in class. And we are going to, these are going to be what you're looking for when we see you guys. So just remember what your character looks like. And of course, by now you already know your character's name. Fantastic. And the next set of you guys, um, oh, I skipped a slide. There we go. So Stella, Ellen, Zoe, Silas, Annie, Summer, everybody knows what you look like and what you're looking for. This is the first time you will be on stage, except for Gaston. You don't come on until you're solo. But everyone write this down now, okay? So just to remember, we have from the downstage zones one, two, three, in the middle zones four, five, six. This is going from stage right to stage left and seven, eight, nine. So you'll write this all down. And so, for example, if you're a candleman, you're going to be in zone eight, close to zone seven, or you could just say that you're upstage right center. Okay. Um, and this is where you will end up, but it, you will not be on stage at the beginning. So I will tell you your cue lines in just a moment, but this is where you will end up. The beginning of the show, um, you, Summer, you are going to come out of that doorway from balcony left. And whenever we have little town full of little people, the little people, we have five people, it's their cue to walk on. Aristocratic lady, sausage girl, girl, fish man, egg man, and baker. So again, that's Allie and Alexa and Ivy and Cynthia and Charlie. All of you will enter. It doesn't matter where you enter from, but your cue is little people walk on, waking up to say bonjour, bonjour. Bonjour, bonjour, bonjour. Then we will have a traffic pattern emerging. Allie, you will be number one. Charlie, you're number two. Ivy, Fishman is number three. Eggman, Cynthia is number four. And you're gonna follow this traffic pattern. Meanwhile, and the cue for that is there goes the baker with his tray like always. There goes the baker is also the cue line for everybody else. Lady with a cane, lady with a baby, candleman, hat seller, shepherd boy, milkmaid, lefou, and bookseller. So you will enter and come to these spots on there goes the baker. Um, uh, Allie, keep leading your line and you're gonna be paired up. So aristocratic lady talks to lady with a cane, lady with a baby, talks to Sasha Scroll girl, candleman, talks to fishman and hat seller, talks to egg man. Now you guys are not actually talking. You are just acting and miming on stage. And remember, as Belle says, it's such a uh, provincial town and it's very dull for her because Belle likes to talk about ideas and stories and inventions and everyone in the town they just like to talk about how much grapes are worth or what kind of apples they got or they want to talk about what the gossip all right and that is super boring so we are being oh i'm gonna turn it so you can see me maybe let's see there we go so you can see my little face right here they're doing big big gestures, they're saying, oh, I know, right? So silently, and maybe you can use your props, all right? If you have eggs, you can offer to sell them to someone, and we are just all miming, being wonderful backstage actors. Um, to this poor provincial town, good morning, Belle. This is happening in zone two with Alexa and Summer. 
Then we will have six people, lady with a cane, lady with a baby, candleman, fisherman, foster pro girl, aristocratic lady. You have your duets coming up. So you are going to get ready and go into zones one, two, and three. You're going to get ready. That's nice. Your cue is Marie the Baguettes, hurry up. Marie the baguettes hurry up is also the cue for all these people to go in the direction of your arrow okay so shepherd boy milkmaid will go into zone five hat seller is going to walk down to zone two Eggman in zone seven lefou will actually exit and bookseller you can stay there um you will actually be in front of the led panel because it says books bookstore this is where you will end up so all you five people gradually go to these positions okay so we're not walking like we're in the airport trying to get our flight or we need to go to the bathroom really fast we are meandering okay i love that word so you have a basket in your hand and you're stopping to look or you're stopping to chat with someone or oh i need to re refasten my shoe buckle or whatever it is okay you're gradually getting to these points you will get to these spots on no denying she's a funny girl that bell when we all sing so just a reminder marie the baguettes hurry up there's a long while to get to these positions. So if you don't want to leave in at Marie the Baguettes Hurry Up, you can leave later. Just gradually get to these positions by, not, by the time we are all singing. So meanwhile, these six people, your cue is definitely Marie the Baguettes Hurry Up. You will be going to these respective places. And I really need Lady with the Cane and Aristocratic Lady get really close to each other. So it's not going to look like a line of six people on stage. It's gonna look like a group of two, a big space, a group of two, a big space, a group of two. Got it? And then the baker, you can kind of go hang out in front of your bakery. Meanwhile, during this bell, you are going up onto the riser or you can just hang out in zone eight. You're just kind of wandering. Uh, everyone else is still on stage. I just took them out of this picture so it's not as complicated. This is what it will really look like. On no denying she's a funny girl, that bell. By this time on that bell, lady with the baby, go up and talk to Eggman and Baker, come on down and hat seller replace so your center stage downstage in zone two. And then we have our little more duets. Bonjour, good day, how is your family? By Hat Seller and Saucer Crow Girl. Shepherd Boy and Milkmaid come down on how is your family? So you are center, you are downstage as far as can be on Bonjour, good day, how is your wife? Then we have I Need Six Eggs, that's too expensive. One of my favorite parts. Everyone that is in zones one, two, and three, you will be getting ready and you're gonna exit wing one, stage right. So write that down in your blocking. Uh, the cue is I need six eggs, that's too expensive. Except lady with a cane and aristocratic lady, don't walk away until after your lines and after you sing. Eggman, lady with a baby, you are going to be exiting also and you exit wing three, stage left at on, that's too expensive. So. By that time, everyone should be off, mostly off, when Bell sings, there must be more than this provincial life, and we're all exited. Um, we all have all exited. So everyone, fishman, candleman, baker, you're gonna lead us out. Now, this is important backstage traffic. I call it traffic because backstage is dark and there's a lot going on and there's a bunch of people, all the enchanted objects, people who are not in this scene but singing, they're backs against the wall during this. They are singing, but they are not gonna get in your way. You three are gonna walk all the way backstage and then go wait into wing three, stage left. You see it right there? You're gonna wait behind Lady with the Baby and Eggman, okay? If you do crisscrossy, cuts no, cuts no butts, no coconuts, if you decide to get in front of someone, it's not gonna make the correct order. So I'm gonna go show you what your order will be. See, so Fishman just led her group and Hat Seller, you're going to lead your group and you're going to be on wing two. Okay, so everyone just stay little ducks in the line. For some reason, Hat Seller's missing from this page, so sorry about that. Um, the only two people who are on stage during the books bookstore scene are just Ellen and Summer. We do not enter until, but sir, I insist. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, so enter, but sir, I insist. And we're going to get in these two U shapes all surrounding Bell, And we all sing, look, there she goes, a girl that's so peculiar. And please, Saucer Girl Girl and Hat Seller, talk to each other, lean in. And, and you're singing these words all to yourself because every single person in the town thinks that Belle is so peculiar. And she's the only one who thinks everybody 
is peculiar. Uh, that's a nice little war going on, okay? Uh, puzzle to the rest of us is bell. We all freeze in a pose, and I want you to pick a dramatic pose, okay? So something like the candle man is doing, I love that pose, okay? Or you can have your um, pose involve your prop. There's lots of props in this number, okay? We, um, um, after she sings, it's my favorite part because you'll see on here's, where she meets Prince Charming on here's, we switch our pose, okay? So maybe I'm looking at Hat Seller and I'm offering her an egg and then you'll see, and then I go look at Book Seller and I'm making a silly face to him or whatever. And then till chapter three, I want these three people, your solos are coming up. So aristocratic lady until chapter three and hat seller come into your proper zones and Eggman, you can wait a little bit until after hat seller solo. So first we have aristocratic lady, um, her looks have got no parallel, hat seller but behind her fair facade. Um, that's when Eggman needs to come in and stand right next to Aristocratic Lady because her solo is very different from the rest of us. Then we all sing, she's nothing like the rest of us. It's different from the rest of us. And the song gets higher and higher. Um, Gaston and LeFou, that is your cue to be waiting in the wings, very different from the rest of us, okay? Right there. And you come on stage. She's not, yes, different from the rest of us, us is Belle, is when you come. You can be on the riser or below. It's going to depend on how tall you are whenever we see you in person. You'll be in zone eight. And everyone else, follow these arrows. We are going out stage or just away from the center because Gaston and LeFou are going to come charging through. And we don't want you to get run over. And we also want to see their smiling faces as they're singing. And Belle, you start sitting down. Okay? So from this point, I'm going backwards because Belle, till chapter three, right away you can start sitting, Belle. Okay? Um, whenever Gaston and LeFou, after they, they might get a round of applause when they enter, that would be so cool. Um, they're going to come to zone five as soon as they can and do their, the rest of their scene and their song. And all the silly girls are going to head all the way to zone one. Now, I don't have all of you guys circled in this class because we have um, four silly girls. So hat seller will be included in this down there. All of you guys are going to come to zone one, including hat seller. Okay. Cause I know that's going to be Peyton, Cynthia, Charlie, and Ivy. So you'll all be in zone one singing this song. Um, your solo, um, look there he goes. And then he's a gentle, dark, strong, and handsome brute. Now comes our crazy part where we have back and forth solos over and over again. I've given whoever has a solo during this section a number, one, two, one through eight. And you guys are going to walk in a diagonal line. Everyone else is just going to find a spot within that diagonal line. Okay, so remember your number if you have a solo at the end. You guys, this class is really good about remembering your solos. This is the area that you're gonna go, okay? So we're gonna walk one lady with a baby. You don't have to turn over your shoulder, just walk straight to your spot. Two, three, four, five, the baker is gonna follow number four. And I have almost made it a diagonal line. Um, again, she shepherd boy hat seller, you guys will be Fill, filling in these gaps. Everyone that's in this number is going to fill in the gaps, but I want six, seven, and eight to be, or six and eight um, to be downstage because I don't want them to be far, as far up when it's their solo time. So Eggman Shepherd Boy, you can be at the end of the diagonal or you can be in the middle. You can be in this little area in between Milkmaid. It's your choice. Candleman Hat Seller, you can come get in this area if you would like to. We're just staying on this side of the stage, aside from these two soloists. And meanwhile, Belle, you are zigzagging all throughout everyone, okay, while you're reading your book. Okay, we're all gonna about to get in two lines. So if you wanna pause here, Milkmaid, Fishman, Lady of the Cane, Candleman, and Sasha Pearl Girl, because we are about to follow these arrows. We are gonna be in two lines. So Fishman through Lady with a Baby, you guys make up line two. Eggman through Bookseller, you guys make up line one. She really is a funny girl, a beauty but a funny girl. Again, we're all talking side to side. We're talking to this person, agreeing, this person, agreeing. She really is a funny girl. And please include the audience, okay? So I'm talking to the person next to me. I know, I agree with you. I'm talking to this person next to me. I know, I. and then the audience. Don't you think Bella is a funny girl? And then we switch lines. 
Meanwhile, Gaston and LeFou are going to be zigzagging throughout, or if it gets too crazy, you can just walk all the way off stage and come down in the center. Belle, this is going to be your traffic pattern. All these people will be here. I've just eliminated them so you could properly see your traffic pattern. All right, Summer, so you'll walk in a circle, reading your book, not running anyone over. And then we have switched lines, and Gaston and LeFou have made it. There we go. Well, Gaston and LeFou have made it around, and you guys are in the corner of zone three. Remember, at the end of that song, you are um, you have a scene with Belle, and you're blocking her from going back to see her father, which her house is right here in balcony left. All right, so it is kind of complicated, but we need to watch this video over and over again to remember. And I'm going to go back fast forward or rewind super fast. So remember that we have our beginning poses, okay, which is technically this, and then our beginning poses. And then the next move that we go to, we come downstage for soloists. And then we have our big complicated set, we exit, and then we have again two circles around Bell. And then we have our big complicated section, which you follow your number one through eight. And then we end by having two lines. So we're going to make another video where we're doing all of this with music. So it becomes a little bit less stressful, but we did it all. You guys did fantastic. So good job, everybody.